What's up everybody? Red Thorn here from Red Thorns Gaming coming at you with Lineage 2 Revolution. Got a Fortress Siege for you today, number 25. So let's get right into it. We have Eternal versus Enigma. Let's check out their combat power. Like we're scrolling down a bit here. There's Eternal and there's Enigma right behind them. About a little under a 4 million power combat power difference. That means absolutely nothing in a fight like this. That is outstanding. Way to be on making that happen. Let us head into the battlefield. Battlefield. Fortress Siege. Okay, or don't go. This is for a B great fortress, Eternal. 32 million and one Adena for the right to challenge Enigma to try to get the fort that they lost two weeks ago, I believe. Let's head in. Enigma on top in the blue. There is Rika Loves Hugs. Hey girl, hey! Leader of Enigma. Running around like a chicken with her head cut off. That is outstanding. More people over here. Alright, well, good luck to Enigma. We have one minute and 30 seconds remaining. Let's head on down to Eternal. Eternal are the attackers in the red. I will be following them. Stacking up on both sides. Looking for that leader. Not much time to do it. There we go. There is Eternal's Leader, Mr. Anderson! Mr. Anderson, all right. Hey, what's up there, Mr. Anderson? Shout out to the leadership of Eternal for making this battle happen. It's the only one that is happening, that is real. Everything else is a bid block, handover, or a waste of time. No, there's no waste of time. It was a bid block or a handover, or it was an all clan bidding for some reason, but who knows what the reason is. 30 seconds before we begin. 10 seconds before we begin! 5 seconds before we begin. And... Here we go! Fourth Siege number 25, Eternal versus Enigma. Should be a good one. Here comes Enigma crashing on down here towards Eternal's non-spawn gate defense towers. Taking them down, there is no Eternal here to stop them right now. There's one, there's King Arthur. He is going against a mob here. Not doing too well. There goes one defense tower. This other one is gone. Eternals is trying to get bullet imprints right now. But Enigma is all alone. Eternal has gotten 10% buff. Oh, interrupted on the 30%. There goes this holy artifact defense tower. Enigma is going straight to him. Not giving a damn about anything. Enigma trying to get their 10% buff. There is Rika. Rika is not trying to get time right now. Penguins taking him down. Eternal, look at this. Holy Artifact Defense Tower almost, almost done. There goes Rika loves hugs. I think she got some stuff, but Eternal trying to get that 30% buff. Enigma. They went straight to him in the beginning, got a little bit of time, and then we're stopped. Eternal trying again. Eternal, three seconds, two seconds, one second. Eternal has a 30% buff in the next one minute and 55 seconds. They could try to turn the tide of the battle here. I don't think they've even broken through the gate yet, but they are about to try right now, that is for sure. They are taking both these towers down. Right tower is gone. Left tower going down quickly. Gone. All right, now they finally broke through the non spawn gate of Enigma. They have a minute and 25 seconds left on the 30% buff. They need to take full advantage of this right now. Here is Mr. Anderson, he's trying to fight his way through, but he has been killed, not good. There is a lot of red here, but no, oh, he's back already. Must have some Eva Saints. They help him out with the resurrection, he's died again. Eternal, trying to go after the Holy Artifact Defense Tower of Enigma. Almost got it halfway down. 
Rika has died again. Penguins getting another streak up on the screen. Enigma has pushed Eternal back. Eternal has 30 seconds on their 30% buff. Mr. Anderson died again. Looks like Eternal is setting up to try to get this Ultra Imprint. And Eternal has taken down the spawn gate of Enigma now. Eternal imprinting the altar of Enigma. They are halfway interrupted. Good interruption there by Enigma. 45 seconds left in Eternal's 10% buff. Eternal is trying again. Three seconds, two seconds. Oh, interrupted. Eternal unable to protect the imprinter. There goes Octo trying to get that 10% buff as their bottom one is less than 20 seconds. And he got it. He was all by himself. Good defense by Eternal. Now they're going to come down here to protect around here. Enigma. Where is Enigma? I see a lot of blue all up top. They're going to try to come down here. Eternal imprinting their own Alter Imprint. Interrupted. Good interruption by Enigma. Eternal trying again. Interrupted. Trying again. Interrupted. Boy, like we've seen so many times, Enigma started off hot and heavy, as other clans have done. They have started off hot and heavy, and then just were unable to follow through and finish it off. Eternal trying again. Halfway there. Interrupted. Rika getting more time. And Enigma doing a good job of not letting Eternal get that 30% buff. They only have a minute and 40 seconds left on their 10%. Eternal over halfway. Eternal three seconds, two seconds, one second. 30% buff for the next one minute and 30 seconds. That's not a lot of time though. I think Enigma is ahead in Holy Artifact imprint time, maybe by a second or two at this point. We'll come on over here where Enigma is going to try to stop Eternal from coming in the non-spawn side. And there's Mr. Anderson. 15 seconds remaining. He's getting a ton of time here right now. 10 seconds remaining. Mr. Anderson is 5 seconds from winning this fight. 3 seconds, 2 seconds. He is by himself. Congratulations to Eternal for taking back your fort. Wow. Quick fight on that. Here are your stats. Congratulations to Penguins for taking the number one spot. I don't know. Enigma, whatever you did last week, I guess it didn't work or you didn't have enough people. Not really sure what happened there. But that was a very fast fight. That will make for a fast video to edit and put up. Now they only made it to 51 on Enigma side and only to 49 on Eternal side. So more or less, it was basically even in terms of members between the two clans, guilds. I play too many MMOs now. Everybody has clans or guilds, whatever they're called. I think they're guilds here. But there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. That was a quick battle. Congratulations to Eternal for taking their fortress back. I don't believe there was anybody else. I'm pretty sure there wasn't anybody else. Other than that was a handover, I know that. And there is Eternal sitting back in their B-grade fortress. Hey, will we see Eternal versus Enigma 3 next Friday? 
Anything is possible. Ladies and gentlemen, hit me up on Facebook and Twitter. Share this video. Come hang out with me on Discord. Thanks so much for watching, and I will see you again.